Welcome to Evolution of Self with me, Britannia. Hello. I want to talk to you about who you're being and how who you're being out in the world does make a difference. And the reason I want to share this with you this week is because I was having a conversation with somebody and I think it was about recycling or something and they were saying that it doesn't really matter what they do because there's so many people in the world that what they're doing doesn't really make a difference. And I beg to differ in quite a strong way because if no one ever does anything because who they are and what they are doesn't make a difference, then nothing will ever change. And it's more than that as well. Who you're being in the world, although you might think that it doesn't make a difference, it doesn't affect anyone, it doesn't change anything, you have absolutely no idea of the repercussions of who you're being and how it affects others in the world. A simple smile to somebody who's having a down day can change their whole entire day. A, a lovely comment, um, something to sort of make somebody feel better about themselves. Doing something like recycling or doing something to make someone else feel better or going out of your way to help somebody or speaking up for something that you don't think is correct or right or standing up for somebody who's being treated badly. You have no idea of who is going to see you doing that, who might take it on and be inspired by what you're doing and how that can change not their life but other people's lives. How things grow from who you're being is an unquantifiable ripple effect. So to say that what you do doesn't matter is just so completely and utterly wrong. What you do and who you're being is a huge, huge thing. And you have no idea of the impact it has on the world and on other people's lives. So instead of giving yourself an easy out, <laughs> I'm thinking that it doesn't matter. I'm here to remind you that it does matter and that who you're being is an incredibly important thing to your world, to your life. Um, you know, and we've been talking about the impact that it could have on others' lives and on the world and whatever else, but there's also the impact on your own life. Who you're being and how you show up in the world is information that you take in about yourself. If you're somebody who you would like to admire, if you're being somebody in the world that inspires yourself, then it changes again who you're being because you show up as somebody who is proud of themselves, who is happy about who they are, who is proud of who they're being in the world and the change and the difference they're making. Whereas if you're somebody who doesn't do things and gives themselves an easy option, how you see yourself is a completely different way. You might feel mildly ashamed of who you are. You might feel inadequate. You might feel that you don't even like the person you've become. So who you're being, it has huge impact. And just sort of take this train a little further. So we've talked about who you're being and how it impacts you and how it changes how you see yourself. But just take that a little further in a thought experiment and imagine if you are being the person that you would admire, how would you show up differently in the world? How would you interact with people differently? How would you interact with your work and your colleagues and the external world? And how would that change opportunities, um, experiences, um, the relationships that you have? And then flip it over and pretend that you gave yourself the easy out and see how that affects who you're being. See how that affects your relationships, affects the work that you do, affects your connections and your opportunities that show up for you in life. And then tell me that it doesn't matter if you don't do the things that you think you should do. <laughs> and on that wise, wise and wisdomous, if there is such a word, note, I will leave you to your next week. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you want to know more about my coaching or any of my online courses, all of the links will be down in the show notes below. So much love from me to you. Bye-bye.